Uh, I can't really tell your color because of uh, the red lighting, but are you black? I'm a nigga. I'm African. You could just say you're black. We, we, we can work with black. That's fine. Um, um, are you in a relationship, ma'am? Mm-hmm. Is this your age up here, 21? I'm 20. Okay. Are you in a relationship with a black man? Mm-hmm. Okay. Let me ask you a few questions then. Yeah, what you about to ask me? Well, <laughs> black... <laughs> Black women, when they do get with black men or marry them in that case, <laughs> they tend to divorce us at an 80% rate. Mm-hmm. Most women have babies outside of wedlock, right? Mm-hmm. Black kids are born at an 80% rate out of wedlock. Why do you feel like black women don't want to be with black men? Because niggas ain't shit. What does that and mean? That means like... You feel me? Like, niggas don't be shit, for real. Like, you feel me? Niggas don't really want to be taking care of their kids. Like, niggas be fucked up out here. Like, niggas be fucked up, for real. Like, that's what that means, for real. Like, yeah, for real. So, there was a poll taken with every race, and it shows that black men make the best fathers. How, how, do, how do you feel about that? I think that's true. You just said men ain't shit. They not shit, but when they fathers, like when the ones who really do be stepping up and being fathers, like they do be making the best fathers. They do. The ones who care. The ones who give a fuck. So you don't think it's anything on the women? I mean, yes, us as black women as a whole, we we do have our toxic ways, our manipulative ways. You know, we do. I can't admit that. So, yes, it, it, it has to do with both, both sides. Right, but I feel like black men have been trying to make strides, but black women continue to just say we're not shit. Black men are gonna be black men, like black. It's just y'all are y'all are y'all. You know, it's nothing else to it. Okay, you're dating a black man, so is he not shit? Oh, he's shit. Okay, he's he's shit. How, how long y'all been together? <laughs> oh, we haven't been together for long. Let's. Less than six months. Yeah. Uh, you think after six months you uh, would you be say yay or nay to marrying this man if it was six months out? Yeah, he has the material. Okay, so when that six month reaches its peak, you'll take the engagement ring. Yeah, I'll take that. I will. Oh shit! Okay, well, you got me there. Fair enough then. I appreciate you. Thank you for your time. Thank you. I have a couple questions. Y'all can just answer this yes, for me. Sir. Okay, so I'm just going to throw a couple numbers at you. You let me know what you think about them. <clears throat> so, black men, black women, the least married out of any race in America. Black okay. women tend to divorce black men at an 80% rate. Why do you cheat. think that is? Okay. <laughs> because what? They get pregnant with the side hoe. I'm sorry. Wait, wait a so minute. Black wait women should be trying to make it stay. No, I'm not saying black women are innocent. They cheat too, but it's most time men. I'm sorry. Uh, it's 28 to 24 percent. So women cheat a four percent less rate. So it's not like a big gap. Yeah. What? I agree. I agree. Well, like I said, women ain't innocent either. Okay. Uh, 80 percent of black kids today are born out of wedlock. So that means most black women are having sex outside of marriage. Why do you believe so that? Are men. Uh, most so are there's men. more men who are childless than black women. Oh. Dang. Remember this. Oh, le- wow. Yeah, there's more of y'all than there is of us. So. Can't, can't, oh, can't. True. So, true. so why do you, Sorry. and a lot of black women, the way they talk about black men, if y'all have ever heard the word men ain't shit, it really started with okay. niggas ain't shit. Why do you feel like black men, I mean, black right. women have right. this thing for us? Because y'all ain't shit. <laughs> why is well, that? Me, like, what makes I'm, us I'm not shit? This. I'm gonna say this. I'm gonna say this. Say yeah. Black men don't know how to treat their black women as such, and they look for other women who they can talk down to and do worse what? when black people, when black women do the most for them. Like they, they black women, the black women I know, they go back for their men and they men do, they niggas do nothing but cheat. Okay. Black men when polled are the second most wanted out of all men of any race. When polled True. again, black men were told they make the best fathers out of any race. So how are you saying that black men don't do anything for black women? The reason why is because most men, they don't own up to their stuff. They think just because, oh, I got this, I can leave it alone and move on. No, you're supposed to get up and do what you need to do as a man. Well, you remember what I said earlier when I said women leave us more than we leave them? (laughs) So, Uh, 
black men don't tend to divorce black women. Well, that's because y'all want us to stay after the bullshit y'all put us through and embarrass us. So, you know, some of y'all be manipulating black women into doing, into going through the same cycle over and over again. And then when we get to the point where we're tired of it and leave, y'all want to get mad and sassy and be <laughs> mad about it. You say leave. One in four black women will ever marry. Y'all are the least married out of anyone in America. So who are black yeah, women running? To, what, who are black? Who are black women running to? If they're not White take, that's right. vibrators. <laughs> so, okay, and y'all also <laughs> buy dogs, right? <laughs> so that's what y'all gonna y'all are just gonna buy vibrators and die alone? No, I don't need. Hey, I, don't, no, I don't do that. The goal is the goal in life is for you to reproduce. That is the y'all do that well just without us. Oh, true. <laughs> Shit, that should tell you something. That's that's the reason. That's the problem. That's the problem. That's the but y'all, I, I get what you're saying, madam. But y'all have like three kids, three baby daddies. What's that about? Oh, niggas don't know how to pull out. I'm sorry. Be oh, safe. That's <laughs> pull out. Damn, why is it always us? Plan B. I'm saying, I'm not saying women. Women need to do better with choosing niggas who they fuck with. Find better dads and stop giving this to any nigga just for money. Niggas just females just as worse. I'm not gonna lie, females just as worse. Okay, so you would put the blame on both equally. Both. It's equal. I mean, men do more stuff than women, but then sometimes it's certain, it's certain things. They both do tit for tat. So each different categories, like men cheat more and females like get away with it more. Like different stuff like that. Okay, that's excellent. So uh, one last question. How come then black men, when we do go to another race, we can stay married, but black women can't get anyone? Because they let y'all run over them. Not going to lie. <laughs> White women, they'll take you back. They'll take you back. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Black women are not going to have that shit. You don't like y'all cheat at almost the same rate. You keep going back to the cheating. <laughs> of course, but y'all do be cheated. But so sorry. do y'all at almost the same rate. When men Which cheat, you're not wrong about men do that, not. But... Men, women cheat like emotionally. Men cheat physically. Now, I'm not saying all women. I mean, you could do both. You could do both. You could do either. But nine times out of ten, what do you, what would you rather like get cheated? Which way would you rather get cheated on, physically or emotionally? Okay, so, okay, so if a guy goes out and has sex with a random woman, and that's the oh, end yeah, of, that's well, hold on, hold on, because why did you come to me? Well, I'm just saying, if he has sex with a random woman, that's the end of the discussion. He comes right back home to you, and life goes on, and no, you never knew about it. He he doesn't buy her cars. He doesn't he buy her nothing. It was a sexless night. But see, if you go out and find a man, you're gonna start, you know. You said you become emotionally involved, right? Of course. Right. So that means you're giving something to him and giving something to her. A guy can fuck a girl and then be on it on his day, and that's it. Conversation's over. He won't ever call her again. You rather be? I'd rather be okay with that. Not saying it's right, but I'd rather get that than a woman who's giving herself to some guy at work that she calls her work husband every damn day until. He right. He right on that. Though. He he right on that part. Yeah. Preach it. Hmm. Okay. Hallelujah. You know, I'm still young. I still have a lot to learn. So I feel like this is a conversation that, you know, kids our age and adults, we young need adults need to have. And I appreciate yeah. that for you bringing up the conversation and thank the topic. You, I'll, I'll thank you guys for being honest. I appreciate y'all. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. How are we going? <laughs>